Do you know, one of the saddest things that, that uh, I, I discovered in, in the Foreign Office is that every uh, British Prime Minister, every Foreign Secretary comes into office, I think in the last 10 years or so, thinking that they can have a, a reset, thinking that they can have a normalisation. I think it goes for Dave, it goes for, for every, every Prime Minister, uh, thinking that they can turn things around. It certainly went for, uh, for uh, Bill Clinton. Me, and, and what happens is they try, they try, and Russia always lets you down. And it's so sad. Uh, I wanted to, things to go better in our relations with Russia, but when it comes to something like the, the Skripal poisonings, it's very, very difficult to find any defense or excuse for their behavior. Using chemical weapons on the streets of a place like Salisbury is absolutely inexcusable. And I, I'm sure that that's what uh, Theresa will have said to, uh, to Vladimir Putin, and she's, she's totally right. Uh, one of the things I was, I was proudest of when I, was, when I was Foreign Secretary was actually orchestrating a, uh, a, a global response to what happened in the UK. And we got a total of 28 countries to kick out 153 Russian diplomats. And that's a, that's a lot when you consider that every country that took that, took that risk was going, to be, was going to face retribution from Putin for doing so. So, so uh, I think that was a, a testimony not just to the, the power of, of, of the UK's influence, but also to the global sense of, of repulsion at the way Russia behaves.